Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be closing out my fall project use it up. So I've had this project going for I believe this is the third month now. And um, I'm going to show you guys what I've finished, what I've made progress on, and just kind of like wrap the whole thing up. And then we're going to start on a winter project actually after this one. So I'm super excited. Stay tuned for that. Subscribe down below and let's get started. So first I want to go over what I kind of already finished. And we'll start off with those. So for candles, I did finish blueberry pie. Finally, it's been in since the start of this project. And I'm not going to lie, I started to get sick of it at the end but it is a really, really good scent. Yeah, it's just like super juicy blueberries, really good. I think um, I got as far down as I could. It kind of stopped burning and like tunneled out. Um, so I got as much use out of it as I could, but it's a really good scent. I think I'm gonna wait a while before I try to get it again or get something similar like a pie scent because I don't know, I just kind of got sick of it at the end, but it was really, really good, a great burner. The next candle that I finished is the White Pumpkin Vanilla, this like little mini single wick from Hobby Lobby. And I burnt this one as far down as it would go. The wick kind of like um, fell over at the end. But I really liked this um, fragrance. I've said this before, it smells like, um, what is it? There's some white pumpkin scent from um, Marshmallow Pumpkin, white marshmallow pumpkin, something like that from Bath & Body Works and that's what this smells like. This, this one, that's what this reminds me of. Oh my gosh. And I really liked it. I enjoyed burning it like at night whenever I took my showers and got ready for bed. So that was good. And then I've been finishing off basically a hand lotion every month. So this month I finished off Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. And this one is really a scent that I've learned that I don't really care for. But I do love the hand creams from Bath & Body Works. So I'm glad to have finished this. And then a body cream that I finally finished. It's been in my project Use It Up for quite a few months, four maybe, four months. Um, it started at, I have measurements on the back here of ounces. It started at 6.4 ounces. And then in one month I did 5.6 and then 4.0 and then I finished it this month. And there is a little bit left in the bottom. I cut it open, but it started to smell rancid and I didn't want to use it anymore. So I'm just going to call it a quits, but I did finish it up and I'm glad to have this out of my collection. I don't really like Pearberry, the scent, but um, glad to have finished that off. And now for the rest of the stuff. So actually in October, it was kind of a difficult month for me to finish things. And of course in November too, um, because I did get sick. I had like a stomach flu, so everything made me nauseous and I couldn't use scents. And then I had like a random breakout of hives. I still don't know what that was about. So I couldn't use anything fragranced on my body for a while, um, just to get the hives to go away. So basically I went maybe three or four weeks without using any fragrance whatsoever. So there's not going to be a lot of progress on all of these things, but I'm not going to kick myself in the butt about it because obviously like I, I couldn't use stuff. What was I going to do? So anyways, that's why the progress is not very far on some of these things, but that's okay. I'm going to show you guys anyways. So the first thing is the sweet cinnamon pumpkin body cream. This one is from last year and um, I started it in the project at 5.4 ounces and then 4.8 and now it's at 3.5 ounces so i'm pretty far i feel like i could use this in the next month i think and i do want to keep this in for winter i think spoiler alert um because i don't want it to go bad um the pearberry one was two years old um from 2018 so it went bad and i don't want this one to go bad so i think i'm going to keep it in for the winter too just to finish it off because i feel like i could finish this pretty quickly but yeah there's that one Again, not a big fan of Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, but I've learned my lesson now. Um, the next thing is another body lotion, Vanilla Mocha Cafe. This one I didn't really get a lot of use out of, um, but I do have some progress on it. And this scent is honestly so beautiful. It's like a beautiful chocolatey coffee scent. So just got a little bit of steady use out of this one. Another body lotion is the Sleep Aromatherapy. This one is old. It's from 2015. Yeah, 2015. So I just want to like keep steadily using it, even if it's like only a little. So last month I introduced it and it was at 
no, 15.1 ounces. So this is like also, it's a glass jar. So it's gonna be, obviously the jar by itself is gonna be pretty heavy. But anyways, I started out at 15.1 ounces and now we're at 13.9 ounces. So I'm steadily using a little bit of it, um, which is fine by me. So I'm just gonna keep this in probably for winter too. I'm like spoiling everything, oh my gosh. Okay, another body lotion that I didn't actually even get to um, is Bonfire Bash. I have no progress on this. I thought I would start using it, but I didn't, so that's okay. Um, let's move on to shower gels. So I have Vanilla Mocha Cafe. This one um, I used this much in a month, and then um, in the last month I only used about this much. So I didn't use this one that much last month, but again, it's like a beautiful coffee, mm, chocolate coffee scent, so yeah. Uh, had a little bit of progress on this, but I haven't finished it yet. And then we have the Hydrating Body Oil in Moonstone. This one I've had in the project for one, two, three, four, five months. Um, I'm just gonna probably keep it in too. Um, but here's the progress lines for you guys, if you can see that. I did actually get about the same amount of use from last month to this month, which is good. Um, so yeah, steady use on that one. Now my hands are all oily. And then I didn't get to use the Sweater Weather um, shower gel, so that one's just gonna go back in the collection drawer. And then for the two fragrance mists that I had, I had Almond Blossom in, and this one, um, I'll show you progress lines, I did not use that much of in the last month. And then Vanilla Mocha Cafe, I used a little bit more. I do have lines like you can kind of see the line of where the fragrance mist is through the clear part of this packaging. So that's where I put it, where I think it is, but I don't know for sure, but not that much use, but I'm glad that I had these in the project for fall. So that way I could use them a little bit and just like even a little bit is better than not using them at all. So, and then the last thing that I have from the project is the Blessed Pumpkin Pecan Waffles um, candle. So I burned this one for a really long time yesterday. It's Honestly, I don't know how I slept on pumpkin pecan waffles for this long and I might have burnt it a little too long yesterday because it looks like the wick might have traveled a little bit. I don't know. I don't remember if it was like that or not before. But anyways, yeah, this candle is so good. It's literally, okay, it's so good and I could use it year round. Like I feel like it's not just a fall scent. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed having this in the project. And um, I wanna say last time that, so the candle is right here. And I wanna say last time we were maybe up here. So I have burned it a few times, um, but yeah, I just love this packaging and the scent. You honestly cannot beat it, especially because I love gourmand scents. So anyways, that is everything for closing out my fall project use it up. Let me know down below what your favorite scents were for this fall season and um, what you used this fall and what you're looking forward to using in the winter. I'm so excited to start the winter project Use It Up. You guys have no idea. So anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.